Okay, here's a diagram representing the problem. We've got this hill that's 42 feet high. Uh, you are standing 73 feet from the base of the hill. And there's a statue on top of the hill that we don't know the height of, so we'll call that X. And the statue subtends an angle of 10.3 degrees from where the person is standing. That means if the person looks at the bottom of the statue and then raises his eyes up to the top of the statue, his eyes will have been raised 10.3 degrees. That's what we mean by subtends. The statue subtends an angle from here. So we need a, to find a relationship that includes X. And what I see right away is that in this right triangle, if I call this triangle A, B, C, if I could find out this angle, then the tangent of that angle would be this whole side AB over CB. So let's see what happens. Well, to find this whole angle, I need to find maybe this angle right here, theta. And I can see that in the little black and blue triangle, that the tangent of theta equals 42 over 73. So I'm going to make note of the fact that theta equals the inverse tangent of set 42 over 73. Of course, we want to do this in degrees. <clears throat> and now the equation that relates, that includes x would be this, the tangent of 10.3 degrees plus theta, but theta is the inverse tangent of 42 over 73 has to equal x plus 42. That's the side length of side AB over 73. So now I can solve this equation for x. Multiply both sides by 73 and then subtract 42. So x equals 73 times this expression, the tangent of 10.3 degrees plus the inverse tangent, the angle that has a tangent of 42 over 73. And then from that, subtract the 42. There's the height of the statue. Now you can enter that on your calculator. Make sure you're in degree mode. I think you'll probably see that you get an answer of 19.7. So there you go. I hope that clears up at least one strategy for solving for the height of that statue.